Hi, today we will see how to create designed QR codes and images that are hidden inside other images. The workflow is very simple and of course you can find it in the description of the video. First of all you need to choose an image and for that we will use load image node. Let's write a prompt. I wrote a photo of a beautiful mountain and forest landscape at sunset. It should be noted that the proportions of the latent and the image we uploaded match. I work with a control model called QR Code Monster I will leave a link to this file in the description of the video. All you need is to save the file in Comfy folder, Models, and inside ControlNet folder, Refresh Comfy and you can start working. You can see that the strength on one the characters merge into the background. So I increase the strength and Q. Now it feels that the characters stand out too much, so I lower the end preset, which will make the characters blend in with the background a little more. And if that's not enough, I can also raise the start preset, but be careful not to exaggerate with this slider because very quickly the characters will disappear. Let's try now with another picture. Just remember to change the proportions to match the picture we uploaded. We will also change the prompt to match the picture I attached. I am writing photo of cemetery graves and tree at night. As you can see because this image is very different from the previous one, we need to play a bit with the control net. I will raise the strength and press Q, and this is of course a matter of personal taste, so you need to find the point that suits you best. And now let's do the same process, only we will use a QR code as a basis. I created the QR code on this site, I will also leave a link to this site in the description of the video. I put in the URL of the Pixel Easel YouTube channel and now we can use that as our base image. Pay attention to the proportions and because it is a black and white image, we can probably work with a lower strength. And so that we can scan the image and get to the site, I will also change the start and end back to default. Let's change the prompt to what we want, I will write photo of beautiful landscape, horizon, and press Q. If you want to give more weight to the landscape than to the QR, then you can increase a little with the start preset, so that we get a little more of the landscape mixed in the QR code, but be careful not to overdo it because then it will not be possible to scan the QR. You are welcome to try and scan the image and if you have reached the Pixel Easel channel then don't forget to subscribe, to like and say hello. So I hope you learned and we will meet in the next lessons. And most importantly, have fun. Bye.